There's only there's no reason to hole up in my room and stare blankly into space. Uh, since there's time, it'd be great. It'd be a great idea if I went ahead and talked to everyone. I know it's sudden, but it's time for a brief tutorial. During the school trip, there'll be free time. I get to hang out, strengthen my friendships, uh, give them a present. You can obtain presents from the Mono Mono Yashin, Mono Mono Yashin, and the vending machine at the supermarket. When you strengthen a, a friendship, an intimate event, an intimate event. Wait, can I date or is this just the same as the first game? Also, if you show any hope fragments you've gathered uh, to Usami via report card, you can gain new skills. Feel free to strengthen your friendships with as many people as you want. Uh, also, when you spend time with someone, time will pass uh, and you return to your cottage afterwards. After time, after passing time several times, your free time will end and you'll continue the main story. By the way, you can skip free time by resetting in your cottage bed. Although I don't really recommend it, please use it if you just want to continue the main story right away. Free time. It's free time. Free time. Let's go. I can give my pet gifts you like. I can give my pet gifts? Why would I do that? Why would I not give people I like gifts? How many? Okay, guy. How many Monokuma? How many hidden Monokumas are there? I need to go to the store. Is this the same as the first game? Whoops! Didn't mean to press A. I meant to hold B. There's a lot? Is there one in every area? If I go to the store, am I gonna find a... Is there, like, one there? It's not really... I, I feel like... I feel like I want you guys to tell me if like there's a hidden, if there's a hidden Monokuma when I'm in a location. There's five hidden Monokumas per chapter. So what? Hey, I'm not hanging out with you. Everyone's just hanging out out here. This is weird. I need to go to the store. There's 30, holy fuck. There's 30 in total. I'm spending time with Nagito. Nagito's a freak. I don't like Nagito. I'm gonna spend time with who I want to spend time with, and that's Akane. Oh, I saw one. Bitch. Huh? Are you serious? Got him. So is there now I got two. So is there five? Also, Akane's here. So is there five Monokumas on like the first island? Did I find them? <laughs> or like the first or something from the vending machine? Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's try purchasing something. These are the gifts, right? Oh, I can pick exactly what I want. Oh, this is different. This is way different. Fifty. These are so expensive. They said there was another one on the beach. Should I go to the beach? Is the one on the beach cheaper? All right, I'll be right back. I'll be right back, Akane. There's also the random one. What do you mean there's a random one? <gasps> my poo, my pet. Oh, it tells me when my pet needs a... Uh... Oh, it's hatching. It's cocooned. That's different. He said there was another, uh, another, the, the Monokuma thing on the beach, which I didn't know what he was talking about. I didn't, I didn't remember one at all. Where's the beach? Here's the beach. Stepping on the beach. Is it, is my pet going to evolve in, does my pet evolve into the same thing every time? Or does my pet evolve into very specific things? Or is it like randomized? Mono Yashin. Why is there a monkey up here? Where'd the monkey come from? Would you like to try your hand against the almighty Mono Mono Yashin? What is the Mono Mono Yashin? Let's give it a shot. I don't know what's happening. Oh, this is random. So what do I get? These gifts. This is better. This is more bang for my buck right here. 
I don't know what Akane would like. She likes food. Wait, it told me her likes. She likes food. Meat! She likes meat! I need meat. I could have bought some meat at the other machine. I think it cost like five. I'm gonna save like five coins. Did I got I got Wait, did I just get Falcor? Did I just <laughs> Did I just unlock Falcor from Neverending Story? What did I just get? Oh, a present. Oh. I actually never knew this existed. I didn't know this existed because obviously this wasn't here when we were initially on the beach. But they mentioned that there was a thing on the, the beach. So I was like, well, I guess there's I should go to the beach and get some stuff. Because the, cause the, the, the machine cost like way too much stuff. I'm going to say five. Because I need meat. Two more. Lucky! Hell yeah. Sunflower seeds. Same gifts. They're the same gifts from the first game. Come on. Shoes. I didn't get any meat. All right, we're going back. We're going back. The ring with the G should go to Gundam. Wait, so what did Akane like? Here she is. She likes fighting and meat. Do I have either of those? Mineral water. Kokoshimi. Ooh, a coconut. None of this is meat. A specter ring. A blonde earthling was wearing this ring when he was swept into the world from the distance. Yeah, I think uh, Gundam would like that. I don't think I have uh, meat. Girl with a bear hairpin. A masterpiece from a realist artist. Wait, where's Falcor? I unlocked Falcor. Wait, where was Falcor? Oh, here it is. Oh, Falcor! A muffler crafted from the fur of a legendary luck dragon. <laughs> Would like that. The mineral water might be good. The mineral water is like so, so basic. Like, here's a gift. Water. A water bottle. No one's like meat. You give them food. Now that, that's what we're talking about. People respond well to food. You know what I'm saying? Uh, purchase. If I'm not mistaken, there was meat here, right? Oh my God, I've unlocked way more stuff. Baguettes. Jerky, that's meat. Uh, that costs three. Blue Ram, these are drinks. What's this? Jabby and jewelry. Is there, can I inspect? Oops. I guess not. Tissues, Bojo dolls. I guess jerky is meat. Yeah. Jerky is meat. What happened so far? Mainly the rules. All right, we're spending time with Akane. You want something? What should I do? Should I invite Akane to hang out? Absolutely. Uh. Hanging out with you isn't exactly all that's exciting. Uh, we can make it exciting. We'll find something. Oh, well, it's fine. I'll, may, I'll turn her around. I spent time after today staring blankly into space with Akane. Good enough. Looks like Akane and I grew a little closer. Should I give her a present? Absolutely. Don't need to buy more meat. Chocolate chip jerky. Wait, dried beef sprinkled with chocolate chips? Yeah, that's meat. How do I give this? Oh, why? Sorry, I forgot. I forgot the controls. <laughs> this one, this one. I gotta have this one. As long as I got one of these, I'll be good to go for 10 yeah. days. Hey, you. Hmm? Um, what? What's your name again? Ah, uh, shit. She's forgotten. It's Hajime. Hajime Hinata. All <laughs> oh, right. That sort of sounds like your name. Sorry, I keep forgetting somehow. Wait, is this relevant? I keep forgetting. Same thing. This happened in the first game. Same thing. Uh, I'll remember it easier if you give me food or something. Well, I already gave you food. Are you an animal or something? Yeah. Oh, well, later. Oh, wait, hold on. We only just started talking. Well, even so, I'm not interested in someone who looks like they have low fighting power. Just from looking at you, you're probably around uh, two. 
I don't deal with anything lower than trash, you know? What kind of measurement system is that? Like, why are you focusing on fighting power? That doesn't matter in gymnastics, right? Huh? Gymnastics? What are you talking about? I mean, you're the ultimate gymnast, right? <laughs> oh, that. Setting records and winning competitions is easy money. Money? You're doing it for the money? What? Yeah, that's right. I've been doing that since it was, uh, doing it since this really persistent old man convinced me to give it to a try. Some old wise sage who also trained Sakura, perhaps? I've been running and jumping all over the place ever since I was a kid. You know, it's, uh, what's it called again? That thing where you run nonstop through a bunch of cluttered areas? Is Akane talking about that? What am I, what am I saying? Uh, it's when you keep running and you jump around obstacles and buildings. Oh, parkour, dude! Dude, hardcore parkour? Yeah, that's it. That's exactly it. That's what the old man called it, too. Well, it doesn't matter what it's called. When you got people chasing you, you just naturally end up doing parkour when you're running away from them. You should try chasing me sometime. I seriously won't get caught. Uh, what kind of situations did you get yourself into where you need to do parkour in the middle of a city? She's pretty crazy, but I'm a little jealous of how careful she is. Got a hope fragment! After continuing a mostly one-sided conversation with Akane, I left the area. Well, I'm out of coins. I no longer have food to give her. If there's more free time, I'm out of food. It's still bright out? Shit! I'm out of food! I, f I didn't feel like anything. So maybe I should go somewhere. Shit! Oh, no! I'm out of food! I need to find another Monokuma bear. Is there one in the hotel? I need to find another hidden Monokuma. <gasps> My pet?! It's a snake? It's a snake! I got a little snake. A little snack. I'll call you... Snack. S-N-E-K. I should check the trees. What trees? Where? Trees in what area? Is there no Monokuma in the hotel? I need to train? I'm gonna train with Akane. If I wanna train to go stronger, she's gonna be the one to train me. Well, of course, this woman is here. What was her name again? Chikai? Ch Ch Chiaki. Chikai. I was close. That's true. If I don't I if I if I don't get another coin to buy her meat again, I'll hang out with someone else. Point me to the direction of more Monokuma. The airport. There has to be one at the airport, right? The airport. We're going to the airport. We're not spending time with Chiaki. We're not spending time with Chiaki. Hey, there's a Kane. I need more coins. Chiaki. Chiaki. Too many people want me to spend time with Chiaki. I feel like the same with Kyoko. What am I going to learn from her? Am I going to get anything? Am I going to like coom over her? <gasps> you bitch. I saw you. I saw you. I knew you could do it. We got it. We got it. There should be two more. As far as removing the engine, whoops. If there's five in each area, there should be two more somewhere. I don't know where they would be, though. Perhaps the park. Perhaps it'd be another one at the park. I'm gonna buy another meat stick for or more jerky. The beach? I was already at the beach, and I didn't see one there. The other two don't appear yet? Ah, oh, Very well. Let's try purchasing something. Alright, we're gonna buy another jerky. This is for Akane. Uh, but... Should we hang out with someone else? I wanna make sure I hang out with the people before they die. 
you know? And I don't want to spread everything out. I'm going to spend time with Akane. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. We're spending time with Akane. Did my snake poop? Does, do snakes poop? Snakes don't really poop. Snakes don't really poop. But Ibuki? Who was Ibuki? Was Ibuki the, the weird girl? The, the masochist? Which one was Ibuki? This one, right? That's not Ibuki. Which one was Ibuki? Oh, this one was Ibuki. Who would I hang out with? Akane, then Gundam. I like the princess. Sonya, Mikan. Oh wait, Mikan. What your snakes do? They don't poop like a lot though. They don't. They have like cow turds. We're with. We're on Akane's path. I need to figure out her journey to be a parkour warrior. Man, my cottage is too big. I can't relax at all. What should I do? Should I invite Akane to hang out? Yes. All right. I'm gonna look for a place to relax. You can come with me too. I spend time wandering the island with Akane while we look for a place to relax. Looks like we grew a little closer. Yeah. Yeah, let's give her a present. More jerky. You're giving this to me? You know me so well. Yeah. Thanks. You look pretty bummed. Are you even eating, um... Hank? Excuse me? My name is Hajime. Oh. <laughs> oh, you only got the H right. More importantly, why are you so full of energy? <laughs> Isn't it obvious there's yummy food? Soft blankets? My room doesn't leak when it rains? This place is way better than where I grew up. Seriously? Even in this kind of situation? Um... Hmm? You know how it is. It's not that strange to find a dead body at the dump in the morning. What? It's not that strange to find a dead body at the dump in the morning. Oh, she's talking about the life before. I was like, wait, she's spoiling the game. Uh, where are you from? A trashy place where crappy people are all swept together. Unless this was like too far into the story and I was supposed to hang out with another character and we are already talking about dead people. Uh, uh, stuff like this happens all the time. How can you say that like it's no big deal? What kind of environment was she raised in? Anyway, since we never had any money, I did whatever I could to earn cash. I even sold my used panties to this noisy pig who kept oinking. Panties, panties. <clears throat> By the time I was able to legally work part-time, I didn't have to run away anymore. So when you mentioned parkour before, you were talking about... But that probably just laid the foundation for being a gymnast. What kind of part-time jobs did you do? I bet you probably did all that. All did stuff like manual labor. Hmm. <laughs> well, I did a lot of things. For some reasons, my mom's boyfriend always pushed me into doing weird jobs. Huh? Like. At first, one of them told me I needed to do what. It, uh, told me I needed to do was serve food. But I never expected he'd tell me to do like do it like that. I'm pretty sure Kane's talking about being a waitress, but she's talking about like Hooters. Yo, Sunflower, thank you for the follow. What kind of waitress? What did he just tell her to do? To do it like that? No panties. That's a bold claim. Be a waitress with no panties? Roller skating isn't that weird. Cosplay? Cosplay seems specific. I'd probably say cosplay. This isn't Sonic where you roller skate. Cosplay. Did he make you do cosplay? Um... Fuck, is that tasty? Looks like I got it wrong. So then what did he tell her to do? What did he tell her to do? Do I lose like favor points with her if I get it wrong? I really want to say no panties. <laughs> that was it? What, what happened? Well, I didn't know what to do. I mean, he told me to do it without my panties, you know? What? That doesn't make sense, right? There's no way I could do something like that. Of course. <laughs> right? That would totally, definitely make your stomach cold. That's not the issue. What? Man, you're annoying. Talking to you made me hungry again for some reason. Alright, guess it's time to me to have my fourth meal. What? 
what? Yo, Kakyoin, thank you for the follow. As she said that, Akane walked away in a hurry. What kind of past does she have? She comes from a fucked up past. That's what she's grown up with in a fucking a home that can't sustain rain. Her mother's boyfriend is telling her not to wear panties, a dude. Holy shit, she has a tragic past. I parted ways with Akane and decided to leave the area for now. Jesus. Ding dong dong ding. I like ding dong bing bong much better. Was that the bell just now? Could it be? Ahem. Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement. Oh, it's not like sad. It's fucked up. Uh, ahem. Hope Speak. Oh, that has an announcement. Hello, everyone. The fun time you've all been waiting for is about to begin. I wonder what festivities await you. Oops, don't want to ruin the surprise. It was a little meh. Whoops. He said, uh, is that Jabberwock Park or some shit? What did he say? What's the transcript button? Why? Okay, I don't know the transcript button. I'm pretty sure it was X, but X just opens up the thing. I think he told us just to go to the park. Uh, did he just tell us to go to the park? It's in the middle of the night. What's he up to? I suddenly had a bad feeling about all this and got goosebumps sprung up from all over my body. If we're not allowed to defy Monokuma, then there's no way I can ignore this, right? Which means there's nothing I can do and except listen to him. Damn it. What is it now? Uh-oh. 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 He always gathers us to give us a motive. He's going to show us a picture. Who's here? Who's here? Who's where? No one's here. No one's here. The inn. Is this to go to Monokuma Park? Level up! Yeah, 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 yeah. Level 10! What's max level in this game? 99? I always gotta check my pet when I level up. Left. Left is the way to Monokuma park right i need to get i need to get a sense of this map oh. 99 ah uh. hey peko you came too huh i have no choice after all the e handbook clearly states that defying monokuma is not permitted it'd be foolish to resist if it's just going to make things worse. I hope everyone else feels the same way. Soda probably doesn't. That worries me a little. At any rate, we must go to the park. I want to hang out with her. I guess I have no choice, huh? True. I assume everyone else is just there. There's an achievement to have it max? Yeah, you just rubber band the controller at that point. Considering the map just loops, you just rubber band it. Uh, everyone was already at Jabberwock Park when I arrived. Once again, you're late. Did you lose your nerve? I'd, I'd like to deny that, but he's not exactly wrong That's either. Fine. Anyway, it seems everyone is here. How annoying. What is it this time? So freaking annoying. Then you shouldn't have come. I mean... Well, I mean, I don't know what'll happen to me if I don't come. Huh. Since none of us know what'll happen, maybe you should be the one to test that out. <sighs> Hey, me, you may talk like you're tough, wise guy, but wouldn't you be here? Um, we wouldn't be here unless you were scared, huh? too. What? Yeah, yeah. I guess even a big, bad Yakuza like you must have been scared of that monster, huh? Are you? The fuck did you? I fully, I'm not gonna lie. I fully expect him to have a gun on him somewhere, just in his waistband. Wait. Stop it, you two. Fighting amongst friends isn't good. Huh? What did you just say? Friend? Dumbass. I'm not your friend, dumbass. When did I ever become friends with you bastards? Huh? Huh. Let me be perfectly clear. Do it, you know. Huh? Kill someone? You. What did you just say? Huh. Oh, you didn't hear me? Then I'll repeat myself just once for you. I said I can do it. Do it? What are you saying? Don't tell me. Are you being serious right now? Could be a bluff. Could be a bluff. Could be an intimidation tactic that the Yakuza taught us. That the Yakuza taught him. Intimidation. Don't show fear. Hey, Fuka, why don't you calm down Master. for a bit? Don't talk to me like we're friends don't or something. I live in a completely different world than you bastards. Kill or be killed. That's kind of the world I live Jeez. in. The current rules make more sense to me than that play nice and get along what crap. 
If you don't stop it right now, I'm going to get seriously angry. You? Don't treat me like a kid, bitch. Just stop. <sighs> Just stop already. This kind of fighting will not get us anywhere. Also, she can cut you down in a split second. Shut the hell up! There's no way I'm dealing with this kum kumbaya crap. If any of you guys want to die, step forward. I'll be- I'll fucking kill you right now. Starting to get pumped up. Sounds fun. Give me your best shot. Oh, fuck. What's gonna happen if you're this easily provoked? Enough. enough. Holy huh? shit. Akane. I'll back Akane 10 times out of 10. Huh? Fuyuhiko, I understand what you're Don't saying. Worry. I do not intend to dismiss your feelings. There was a time when I also thought the same way Don't as you. Treat me like a fucking kid. Don't treat me like a Let kid, too. But what the, what would reckless killing accomplish if you fail to get away with it? You know you'll be executed. Or perhaps that's what you really want. If so, you'd only be killing yourself to run away from this predicament. That's what a child would do. Fuck, checkmate. You... What did you just say? Listen. Listen, so long as we're here, I will not let any of you die. I will not let any of you become a victim. Dude, what if... I feel like Byakuya is going to die. If Byakuya dies first, this whole thing goes out the window. But what if everyone lives? That'd be a twist. Uh, I will not let any of you... Because the title is called Goodbye Despair. So thus, there will be no despair whatsoever. And that goes for you too, Fuyuhiko. I will not... I won't let you die. <sighs> What the hell? Everything you're saying, it's just empty promises. <laughs> it's true, my words would ring hollow if anyone else spoke them. My name is Byakuya Togami. But I am Byakuya Togami, and I am destined to bring these promises to fruition. <laughs> Yowza, he's so cool. I agree. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait, Terror Terror is a little bisexual, I see. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't care what you say, I'm just gonna do whatever I feel like. <laughs> Do, do what you will. However, remember what I said earlier. In the name of my family. I will not any of you, let any of you become a victim. That is the duty I have appointed to myself. It seems like Byakuya resolved it for now. But even if he's the ultimate Yakuza, there's no way Fuyuhiko really meant what he said earlier, right? Hmm. Okay, Monokuma. Finally, you arrived! This what? It looked like you guys were arguing, so I wasn't sure when to actually show up. It looks like I showed up at an awkward time. Hey, hey. Why are you dressed like that? Hey, um... Oh, I didn't I mention in my recent broadcast? It's my costume for the fun time. Wait. Don't tell me you're going to... Correct. Yo, Summerly Stardust, thank you for the follow. Uh, that's right. Since we're on a tropical island, I'm here to do my two-man comedy routine. <laughs> Why does it matter that we're on a tropical island? But you can do a two-man comedy routine all by yourself. Can you do that? Of course. Of course not. That's why I brought my partner. Oh, uh, oh what is this? Meaningless. That figures. Thank you for waiting. Now then, without further ado, I'm pleased to present Monokuma's side-splitting live two-man comedy show. Hey. Huh? I didn't hear anything about this. Are you telling me I have to improvise? I'm speechless. Dude, Gundam would be good at improvising. Hello. Together, we are the Monokumas! That's pretty good improvising from Monomi for not being in on it. Sus. Now, I know it's sudden, but I guess I should show you guys my amazing mind-reading abilities. Uh, you can read minds? As practice, I'll guess your favorite food. Hmm. Cake. Your favorite food is... You can do it. It's obvious oh, what rabbits like. Shit, I was going based off the colors, not the fact she was a rabbit. Kid. That's right. Cadavers. I'd never eat a dead body. <laughs> Cadavers. Now then, Monami's up next. Come on, do a short skit or something. What? There's no way I can do that. No worries, it's all good. I know a technique to summon the god of comedy. What is happening at the top left of my screen? It says press the left mouse button. Or the right mouse button? What is that? Oh, it's a fucking lat. It's a fucking audience fucking reaction. A good one. Good one, Monokuma. Good joke. So, which do you think is better? 
taking blood while you're still alive or after you're already dead? Why would you ask such a cruel question? If I'm gonna summon the Kama Deity, then I'll need a lot of blood. So, a god of comedy wants blood. Mm, pretty please. No matter how charmingly you ask, there's no way I'll let you take my blood. You're always so quick to make a scary face, Monami. You guys better be careful, too. You know, since Monami's actually a bad guy. A good one. She's as bad as the first villain the hero fights in a teen manga. It's not that bad. It's usually like a, like a high school bully. They're always the underdog. Believe me, it's a fact that Monami's a villain. I'll let you all in on a little secret. I believe that. I'm not gonna lie. I believe it. I still hold true to the fact that Monokuma doesn't lie. Monami went out of her way to erase your memories. Yeah, but you did that too. Say what? You did that too. Wait, huh? You guys don't even remember how you got to this island, am I right? Well, that's because Monami stole your memories. And we're actually all whole high school students to preserve hope of the what outside are you world. All of a sudden? But wait, there's more. She didn't just steal your boring memories, like how you guys got to this island. She completely took away your memories of the years you spent at Hope's Peak Academy. Dude, again? What a shocker. Dude, again? With the whole, like, we all, we're all best friends? Oh, return wow. these memories. I demand you return these memories. I want them back. <sighs> well, her stick is broken. Now that I've shared that with you. Seriously, memory loss plots are so old hat nowadays. Her stick is broken. Only a total hat would wait until the end of the story to reveal a cliched twist like that. All right, little foot. P please stop. Go. <laughs> Wasn't that a huge surprise? In truth, you guys aren't freshman students at all. We're seniors. You guys just thought you were because you've lost all of your school memories. What are we? Quick, someone get a plagiarist because I feel like I've heard this story before. So seriously, this is bad in so many ways. Plunged? I'm through dealing with you. His backhand is far too powerful. That's a backhand? That looks like a fucking jab. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, huh? <laughs> That's... What does he mean? Hey, hey! How was it? Was it funny or was the comedy too highbrow for you? Come on. Uh... Hey, what were you saying just now? Huh? What was I saying just now? Oh, you mean when I said your high school memories were completely stolen? Completely stolen? Are high school memories completely? What is he saying? <laughs> There's no way. Because I just entered Hope Speak Academy and then I was brought to this island right away. It's true. That's because how that's because that's how you remember it. All thanks to Monomi stealing your school memories. What are you saying? That's impossible. Who knows? Man, how many years had passed since you guys first entered Hope Speak Academy? I wonder what happened to your friends and family. They're probably worried sick about you. Maybe. Impossible. Our school memories were stolen? That's ridiculous. That's right. There's no way I have memory loss. You can't. Don't listen to what he says. <laughs> <laughs> Limit breached. I won't believe. I, I won't refuse believe. to believe such a thing. Yeah, everything's okay. I don't believe it. <laughs> You're lying, right? Stealing our memories? That's a lie, right? You're just trying to make fools out of Wrong. us, right? Nope, it's not a lie. If it was a lie, then how do you explain this? The moment you arrived at Hope's Big Academy, you all experienced a strange dizziness. What? How do you know Actually, that? That was the cutoff point. Your memories beyond that point have been completely removed. What the hell? I can feel myself getting lightheaded. This is all ringing a bell. I've been familiar with this plot before. I couldn't think. I couldn't speak. I only breathe in heavy, gasping breaths. So a long time has passed since impossible. then? Impossible. There's Why? no way. On the contrary, why is it impossible? That's... Whether or not it's possible, there's no way we can believe it. No, no. You just don't want to believe it, right? <laughs> but don't worry, I'm a generous guy. I can give you back yeah. your memories. Huh? Hey, 
However, there's a catch. Kill someone. Could it be? Don't tell me the catch is <laughs> figured it out yet. Right. Damn! All of us get our memories if someone so that's a good motive. All of us get our memories if uh or just the person who kills. That's my bargaining point. That's a good one. That's a good that's a good uh motive. Hey, hey! You guys wanna know, right? You want your school memories returned to you, right? Hey, man. Then you better start killing. A penny for your thoughts, a murder for your memories. You piss me off. Stop running your mouth. Well, why? why my uh, why so angry? I'm just providing all the motive from the bottom of my big generous heart. Otherwise, you cowards wouldn't get any killing done. <laughs> Well, that's not your fault. Humans are natural born cowards. They even cry after their mom squeezes them out. That's why I'm giving you a motive. Think of it as an excuse to commit your future crimes. Stop this at once. Do you really think your delusional ramblings will convince us to commit murder? What are you saying? I don't even believe that memory loss crap in the first place. But more than that, what you guys really don't believe is in is each other, on? right? What do you mean? Hey. You guys don't know each other, which means none of you realize that a traitor is. I did. What, what, what is this? What is this plot? What is what's happening? Why is everything so similar? Everything is clearly re reminiscent and similar and referencing the events that happened in the first game for a very specific reason. The only reason that I don't get is why. Why? What is the what is the game getting at that it keeps referencing the first game? It's so weird. Huh? Why are there 16 of you? A total of 15 students from Hope's Peak Academy were arranged to come I to this island. It. That's right. There's probably a traitor. I don't even know. You, I don't even know about hiding amongst the group. Just kidding. What you. the hell are you saying? All this shit about traitors doesn't make any sense. It's obviously nonsense. Lame. For real, you guys. How can you be sure? You guys don't know anything about each other. You don't know each other's true natures. That's why if one of you is planning to kill someone, it's impossible for you to know. With those words, everyone fell silent. I wanted someone to argue with him, anybody, but nobody said a word. They just stood there. Uh -huh. Even so, if there's really a traitor, isn't that gosh so gosh darn awful? Pretending to be your ally and tricking you guys? It makes sense for someone like that to get killed, right? <laughs> come on, make up the preemptive strike. It's first come, first serve, and winner takes all. If you want to survive, you gotta find the person before they find you. Okay, bye, Monokuma. Thanks. I think it's a lie. I think it's a lie. Even after Monokuma's boisterous laughter faded away, we all just stood there. Every one of us. This situation, this circumstance, this phenomena, this disaster, this nightmare, this hell, this despair. It consumed every one of us. Is it true? Is there really a traitor among us? She said it? Among us? It's not me, by the way. I know I look suspicious, but it's not me. Who is it? Hurry up and show yourself. You're only making things worse by s for you by staying silent. Just stop. There's no way there's a traitor. Uh, there's no way. It's pointless to even discuss something foolish. That's right. I don't believe it. Because there's no way I can believe it. There's no reason to believe it in the first place to believe it. Monomi, you would know. Huh? Is what Monokuma said true about our memory loss and about the traitor? Um, I mean, everyone needs to look to the future. That's why you shouldn't look back at the past. Keep your eyes fixed on the future. Let's do our very best. She ran away? How ridiculous. Memory loss, a traitor. It's completely fictional. I can't deal with this bullshit, dumbass. As he said, it's a work of fiction. It's entirely different from the reality I know. Stolen memories, all my school memories, everything, a traitor hidden among us. But what really struck me was when was what Monokuma said. Uh, you guys don't know anything about each other. No. I know Akane had a very troubled past. And I'm here to make her feel better. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make! It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Well, usually by the time... Oh, shit. Usually when uh, we're given a motive, by the next morning, someone is dead. 
shit. Hey. What should we do? It's better if we call it a night here. We should get some sleep and try to keep our minds calm. Whoa. She's got like a little she got an anime oh. hoodie. I guess you're right. This is your leader's order. Just so you all know, do not think about unnecessary things. This is your leader's order. Tomorrow morning, let's meet at the restaurant at Dermonokuma's morning announcement. Um. How troubling. I think the saying goes, I'm frightened so stiff. Huh? I feel pretty stiff right now, too. Uh. That's not the, how that saying goes. <laughs> Uh, fucking all, all that joke almost went right over my head, but it's not her fault. She's a foreigner after all. Sonya needs an accent. What kind? What type of accent does Sonya have? To be honest, I don't really remember what happened after that, but later I realized something. I was sitting on my bed inside the cottage with my head drooling down my chest. Did I walk home? As I sat there alone, a strange thought suddenly crossed my mind. Raider, could it be someone who isn't like the others? Like someone who doesn't even remember what their talent is? <gasps> what the hell? I don't understand at all. I put these stupid thoughts out of my mind and collapsed onto the bed. Could also be uh, someone like the ultimate lucky student who is useless and has no talent as well. Theoretically, he also has no talent. The traitor. We was... Did we ever, like, accuse Kyoko of being the traitor? I don't think so. I mean, I accused her at one point. But the game never did. I put these stupid thoughts in my head and collapsed onto my bed. Immediately, I closed my eyes. Closing my eyes, the only thing I could do to escape from the this otherworldly reality. Burr, 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 burr. Wah, wah. They say impossible is a word that's only found in a fool's dictionary. Obviously, it's impossible to use a word that's not in your dictionary. If someone can actually make the impossible it's possible, if you, say that. you can truly call that person someone who doesn't have the impossible. What? That doesn't make sense. 